This is an example of new features and upcoming releases of Crate Pro. The relationship modifications will allow us to add more complex features, such as the one shown here. You will be able to create unlimited material groups with a great deal more control. Each group can have its own unique name and set of materials. Groups have statuses, active, inactive, and you can delete any group you don't expect to need again. For example, you have a six-month project for your customer. You assign a specific set of materials. When over, you can either set it as inactive so it's not an option for users to select, but still available for future projects, or delete it entirely if you won't use it again. The entries in these tabs will apply to the specific material group selected. Classifications are informational only and don't change the design. The information appear on your cut list to provide additional information to staff. Currently, many of these settings are applied globally based on the style family. In this release, you can be very specific. Fields that are grayed. Use your company defaults just as they do now in the current release. This makes setting custom preferences fast and easy. Crate Pro allows you to add up to three sets of assembly fasteners. A fastener set is created in the inventory module and may, for example, consist of a bolt with a washer and nut. Fastener placement will allow you to select a specific fastener or fastener assembly and choose a location, such as placing unique edge or corner fasteners and indicating where they'll be placed. Creating new groups is simple. Components are applied in a hierarchy from least detail to most detailed. All of these are dependent on the selected style. If a style does not use the components, they will be excluded. Secondary material groups will give you the ability to, with one click, apply packing materials. You'll be able to filter your secondary groups by type when creating your design, which will give you a tremendous amount of flexibility and time saving when you add your common materials. Being able to print out your material groups is a feature coming in the next release. With the ability to create unlimited material groupings, this feature will be very beneficial with the new more detailed material groups.